Hello viewers, welcome to the Pharmacist Online. In this video, we will unbox Omron M7 Antili IT Ambulatory Blood Pressure Monitor. As you can see here in this video, we will unbox it and we will measure blood pressure with this Omron M7. And in the last of this video, we will connect this blood pressure monitor to our smartphone where we can transfer blood pressure data from this device to the smartphone and we can discuss with our physician any time in the clinic so let's open this carry box as you can see here the device is inside with some components so you should know how to fix it as you can see here this is the booklets you have to read it well before making setting in this device plus you have to read it well before measuring blood pressure and if there is any errors in your device so you have to read this booklets and i am sure you can make correction for that errors this is the arm cuff this is our omron m7 abpm as you can see here it's enclosed very well in a safe packaging so now let me tell you how to install the batteries here remove this one and keep the all battery cells inside properly and let me explain one thing also to you when you remove these batteries so then you have to make setting for the date and time and if you are not using this device for the long time so remove these batteries and keep out from the device to avoid any leakage of the battery cells now we will connect this arm cup to the omron m7 you can see here insert this tube head here and now we will make setting for the date in time as you can see here press this button and the date will appear with the year so you can select here the year format in the month format and also the date format from this button you can change your date and year and also your time and time format so make this essential setting by pressing these buttons select your local time and one thing more when you connect this device to the uh, smartphone so these uh, your date and local time will be automatically corrected and before measuring blood pressure you have to make setting for the time and date so let's make the proper setting here and press this buttons and our device will be ready for BP measurement Now let me show you how to measure blood pressure with all digital blood pressure monitors. First you have to sit on the chair as you can see here in the book let us mention. Sit on the chair and keep device in front of your table. Okay and make sure the arm cuff is straight into your heart as you can see here in the picture also. Okay for the left hand and the right hand the arm cuffing is different i will show you in next in this video let's start measuring blood pressure with the left hand first so take your arm cuff and wrap around your left arm now make sure here one thing you will keep the tube in the middle of your hand as you can see in this video keep the tube in the middle of your hand and hold in the middle of your fingers and one thing more keep the arm cuff above from your elbow at least one to two centimeter as you can see here in the video when i fix this one so i will make sure this is above the elbow and you can see here at least one one to two centimeter above from the elbow okay and the tube should be in the middle of the hand now press the start button and the blood pressure measurement will start automatically.
as you can see here in this device this will give you the systolic blood pressure the diastolic blood pressure and pulse rate also now when we press this button so blood pressure measurement is start as you can see the systolic is start now and one thing this green button up okay will show you your arm cuff is raised properly if there is any problem in the arm cuff so this will be yellow or red as you can see here the systolic blood pressure and now the diastolic blood pressure started and this will give us the result in a minutes as you can see here our diastolic pressure and diastolic pressure and the pulse rate now as you can see the blood pressure result is high but that doesn't mean this there is problem in this device how to measure blood pressure with digital blood pressure monitor you have to watch my video as a link above so you will know how to measure blood pressure properly there are many factors involved which make your bp elevated when you measure blood pressure and your blood pressure is it is high so there are many factors you have to avoid that factors so watch my another video for that one and now here in the right hand this technique is different as you can see here the tube should be in the side of your hand in the inner side of your hand but not in the middle of your right hand now press the start button and the blood pressure measurement will start blood pressure result for the right hand and left hand is different okay sometime sometime the left hand side blood pressure is high so you have to discuss with your physician and he will explain you how to measure your blood pressure with the left hand or right hand because the blood pressure for both hands are different make sure when you measure blood pressure with the digital blood pressure monitors so make sure there is no cloth is on your hands as you can see here the systolic diastolic and pulse rate okay here you can measure blood pressure for another person also and the data can be saved in the device and in your mobile phone also now next in this video i will connect this omron m7 to the mobile app so we can discuss with our physician anytime in his clinic about the blood pressure and here there is one option in this Umron M7 you can measure blood pressure in the morning and in the evening and their data will be saved differently with a sign of morning and evening. Now let's open the play store or the app store and write here Umron connect. As you can see here I have already installed the Omron connect so I will open and if you are first opening it so make the profile and enter the credentials now here look at the mobile phone in this app this will give you the instruction how to pair so press this button and hold for two seconds until the P is appeared here on the screen now next this pattern to connect this device with your phone via bluetooth as you can see here there is bluetooth pairing okay this is uh, open the bluetooth in the mobile phone in allow and give the permission for this one now the pairing start here this will take a few seconds if it's not connecting so make sure to unpair all the device connected with your mobile now here you can register for one person and for the two for another person you see our device is connected successfully and this sign show it's connected properly thank you so much for watching the video one thing i need from you my viewers 
my, a lot of people watch my video but nobody subscribe to my channel if you subscribe to my youtube channel this will encourage me to make more informational videos for you people thank you so much stay safe and healthy bye bye